This time we look at this program called Whitey. It is a command line tool to search and watch YouTube videos um, from the terminal here. So this one was sent to me by one of my YouTube viewers uh, named Brown Pelican 3 So thanks for that. Uh, pretty cool program here. So I'll show you how to use this here. Uh, well, obviously you need to install Whitey, and I'll probably show you that in the end. But you need to install Whitey. You need to install the YouTube DL. Which I haven't made a video on. Maybe I'll make one in the future. But YouTube DL is the backend program to run this. And you need M Player uh, and Python, of course. So that's all you really need. Anyways, the program here is called YT. Um, that's how it's spelled like for the package. Uh, at first, I thought it was freaking racist, but um, it makes sense because the, the program name is actually just Y and T, so YT. Uh, which uh, I kind of cracked up when I realized that. I'm like, oh, okay, that makes sense now. Um, but anyways, Y and T, and you hit enter. And this is uh, the, the interface here. Not that hard. You have all your options down here, right? So you have previous, next, uh, the ordering, search, and you choose the number. This V1 is to choose double digits numbers, so like 10, 11, 12, whatever. Right, but one to nine, you just hit one button. You don't have to use the V here and user. So, for example, if you want to search for something, you hit S, right? Right here, like you hit S. So, hit S, and then you search for, let's say, open source, right? And if you want to choose a video, so since we only have one to nine, we just hit the number that we want. So, for example, I'll hit number two here. So, I hit two, and I'll start playing with M player in a couple seconds here, right? So there you go, that's number two, the video. And what else can you do in here? If you wanna order it, which I think they should rename it to uh, filtering, but whatever. Uh, so you hit O for ordering. And if you wanna sort it by, or order by, uh, let's say view count or relevance, publication, and T for rating. So if you wanna, sorted by a view count you hit V so you hit V here and you see it sorts it by the views here like 7 million 7 million 5 million so on and so forth so that's how you do that um, other things if you want to go to the next or a previous page so then the previous is uh, this bracket the next one is this other bracket so for example I go to the next one right you just hit the next bracket um, or the previous bracket here. That's all you gotta do for that. Anything else you're gonna do? Um, oh yeah, for this one, this choose index. Right now we only have nine, right? But if you have like 10, 11, 12, or whatever, then you would hit V and then you would type in like, you know, 15 or 16 or whatever double digit numbers you have. And that's how you use the, the choose index there. Uh, as far as for user, you just type in U, and you search for the user you want. Let's say, for example, I search for my name here. And you see, there you go, this is all my videos, and I just hit one video that I want. So for example, if I wanna hit number three, it'll start playing it in a couple of seconds. So there you go, this is my videos. Uh, so that's pretty much it for the program. It's not really an end curse, it's more like a, a menu interface. And that's about it, right? So show you how to install this here since it's not available in most um what is that repositories it is in the, the arch aur but not anywhere else but you can always use the was it the pip install that i showed you last time so you can do pip search and then yt right and you see they have it there so you can install it using um well you can use it in sudo if you want Let's, for example sudo pip2 install if I spell it right yt and there you go that's really all you gotta do I'll post you a video in the description if you want to learn how to use uh, pip install but that's how you do it if you don't have it in your repositories already all right um, anything else oh yeah there's one for if you have the raspberry pi they have this um, program it's called pi yt and it works with the Omex player, which I don't have a Raspberry Pi, but they do have that program called PyYT here, right? And it will actually work if uh, 
you have the correct uh, player. Um, but if you're on Linux, you're just going to use M player to stream it only. So that's about it, really. Oh, yeah, another thing is if you have YouTube DL in your repositories, you might have like an older YouTube DL version. So to get the latest version, you want to do sudo YouTube DL uh, dash capital U here. And this one will actually update to the newest version straight from the maintainer itself. So there you go. That's how you got to do. You don't you don't have to do this easy install crap. Just do what I tell you to do with the pip uh, install. It's much easier than the easy install. Uh, so that's it for Whitey or YT.